Six of Grenada's 14 recorded cases of COVID-19 are now negative for the deadly virus. Health Minister Nicholas Steele on Friday delivered the news to the state of Grenada. Yesterday we tested 11 more individuals or received results for 11. All 11 were negative. But Mr. But Mr. Speaker, most importantly, of those 11, six of them were individuals who had previously tested positive. So we can most definitely declare that of the 14 individuals who tested positive in the state of Grenada, six of them have officially recovered. Government ministers also paid respect to frontline workers who continue to be the country's first line of contact with people battling the COVID-19. Taking the lead was Prime Minister Dr. Keith Mitchell during Friday's sitting of the House of Representatives. She owes a great debt to essential workers like that of our health care practitioners. Those who have come forward in this time, not all have done it, but those who have come forward, we need we owe them enormous amount. We cannot pay them for their sacrifices. And all of the categories of workers, Mr. Speaker, who are, class, who are so classified, that wake up every morning to ensure that this country is healthy and safe. The country's sanitation workers were also recognized. Mr. Speaker, this country has remained clean. This is a period, colleagues, that everybody afraid to be outside. But the garbage collectors, the garbage collectors, we need to give a lot of praise. And as I pass them, they wave and, and, and shout to me as if they're so proud to be out there masked appropriately. But this, it's still a dangerous exercise. Government's budget in the stimulus package, $10 million for the Ministry of Health to secure protective equipment for frontline workers, additional testing materials, and other items necessary. Chrislina John, GBN News.